Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Jungle <laughs> Island. In the last episode, if you guys missed it, we tamed this here massive Siberian tiger. I got a suggestion from Nadal D, who wanted the tiger's name to be Shere Khan from the Jungle Book. If you guys have not seen Jungle Book, I don't know exactly where you've been doing or what you've been living. That didn't make any sense. But you guys, you see exactly what I'm saying. You gotta watch Jungle Book. If you go into here, let's do Shere can which is one of the coolest tigers i've ever seen in my entire life when i first saw jungle book and saw shere khan i said to myself i never want to be in a cage with a tiger because it would probably want to eat me but since we haven't done this series in a while i'm sure some of you out there don't know exactly why i am trapped on a jungle island uh, well i got on this boat here behind me and traveled all the way out to this random mysterious island where i discovered my younger brother adam has been hiding out suppose Supposedly he's starting a jungle island zoo and I decided since he's my younger brother I can't let that happen I gotta make my own zoo instead uh, and if you guys have siblings you know that if they try something you gotta do it and you gotta do it better than them now currently right here in our little jungle village we're doing pretty darn well we have ourselves shadow and also uh, the the village's jungle cat which is a little bit uh, scary and looks at me while I'm sleeping to eat me but we also have I believe this is a jaguar Another Siberian tiger. We got Carrie the gorilla and a uh, uh, weird jungle deer creature, which I actually have no idea what it is exactly. We got ourselves a crocodilian and then another gorilla. Now, some of these animals did belong to this here village, but I traded the chief a cookie and I have taken it over for myself. Now, there is a couple animals missing from our jungle village right here, which is why today I am going to be heading out into the jungle by myself to get my hands on a jungle dragon. Now, you guys have been commenting a ton recently that my younger brother Adam has one for himself. Obviously, I can't let that happen. If he has a jungle dragon... Now, obviously, I cannot let Adam be the only one with a jungle dragon because that is probably the rarest and strongest Strongest creature on the entire island. <gasps> Wait a second, hold up. Oh, we have an albino Siberian tiger. Oh my gosh, there's like an entire pack over here. Hold on, ladies and gentlemen. If I can get my hand on a baby white Siberian tiger, that would be so sick. All right, oh, no, dude, that one was distracting me. They're working as a team. Bird, what's up, bird? Can you, can you uh, help me out here? Oh my gosh, dude, they're literally stalking everywhere. They're right next to my island too. Island villagers, yeah, run for your lives. I don't know if they can hear me. Oh my gosh, we have spiders coming coming out to you. We're just gonna scrap today's mission uh, and, and we're, we're just, let's just go back to sleep and we'll try again tomorrow. All right, my new plan is to not take that route and we're just going to go directly over this little tiny area of water to the main island. Why is this boat moving at the speed of a snail? There are giant anacondas in the water and crocodiles. I don't know if I'm going fast enough to get away from them. I'm just, I'm booking it, I'm swimming. Oh my gosh, we got a drowned creature too. We got stingrays. I actually don't think I I've been in the ocean yet on Jungle Island. Dude, what is this? Is this a seal? I think it actually is. And we have like a porpoise too. Ew, what is this? We got an electric eel. Get away from me. <gasps> Sweet. All right, geez, we actually made it. All right, next order of business. There is a, I believe there's like an archaeological campsite around where they were actually digging out the dinosaurs. Now, I stumbled across it in a previous episode. And wait, is it actually right here? <gasps> it is. It's right across from me. That is so cool. I actually had no idea because Adam has access to the main map at his place. Uh, and I forgot to steal it one time. But there's one. Now, I don't know if it's the only one around. The issue is... I don't think I can tame it when it's an adult. I have to find a baby, but I don't know if that's for sure or not. So we're going to go ahead and just slowly sneak up on it. So this is actually a Drake dragon species. As you can tell, it does not have massive wings, but it does have two feet and runs really quickly. It's almost like a dragon velociraptor. Oh my god, really? I got I got a jaguar? Or are you a cheetah? Just get away from me. Why, why is everything stalking me? I'm like half zombie. I don't even taste that good. Okay, while those two are occupied, let's see if there's anything of use around here or if I can find one of the babies. So far, maybe there's one down there. I can't really tell. Hello, are you a baby? Oh no, that's just a monkey. And uh, hey, what's up? Big, big, no! <laughs> please no, please no, please no. 
Oh my gosh, this is something that it, that it just killed like a minute ago. <gasps> well, hello there, Cheetah, or Jaguar. I honestly, I don't really know the difference. I think that might be a Jaguar by the spotting. Oh, okay, there's another one right there. Th this place is overrun with carnivores. Dude, chill. Oh wait, is this mine? It is, okay. This makes a lot more sense. I was very confused why this guy was following me around. Okay, since the <laughs> it's, right, it's right over there. Okay, 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 chill, bro. Okay, I'm I'm gonna feed you, right? And you're gonna be my friend. You're not gonna be my friend. I might actually need to kill this thing. Oh my gosh, dude! I didn't want my cheetah here. This is exactly what I didn't want. Okay, I just wanted to, I, I want to steal one of your babies. I know it sounds awful. I think I actually might die. That was a close call. Good work, big cat. Now the only issue is that seemed to be the only dinosaur dragon in the area. I also am still not entirely sure if it's a dinosaur or a dragon be sure to leave a comment down below but it appears to be some sort of dragon species and that actually might have been a small one they could get a lot bigger now let's look around here to see if there's any clues about where there could be babies obviously people have been here before and they've been digging out the fossils but i don't know exactly what that means let's see metal detector identified precious metal all right cool well problem i don't have a pickaxe on me right about now oh wait a second there's a secret chest under there oh my gosh sweet thank you metal detector monkey i need you to tell me where the baby dragons are i will feed you one cookie the monkeys what do monkeys eat i don't have bananas um i have medium meat you guys are omnivores right sometimes you eat meats okay that's probably a big fat no what is this Oh my gosh, we got we got a little a little capuchin. Maybe it's not a capuchin. I don't really know. There's like a million different uh, monkey species, and I have no idea exactly what they are. I'm starting to get really nervous that that might have been the only dragon in the area, which is why I have no idea where Adam was able to find them. I know for a fact Adam did not build this archaeological site himself, which is why I'm thinking maybe some of the villagers managed to bring them back and tame them. Now, if they have their own tamed dragons, that means that they're breeding them together to get dragon babies. So maybe I can go inland and see if maybe I can find one of the villages and trade them. This is going to be a very dangerous mission, ladies and gentlemen. It's getting nighttime. I need you guys' support. If you want me to be able to complete this mission, go ahead and smash like. That is the only way I'm able to do this. Um, I don't really have that many skills, but every single like you guys leave gives me one more skill. Now, what that skill is, I am not entirely sure. Uh, you know, it, it could be the ability to jump higher, the ability to eat more cookies, or possibly the ability to sleep in the middle of a jungle without dying. I don't know exactly how that's an ability, but that would be a huge win for me if I could figure out how to do that because I forgot to bring a bed and I'm probably gonna have to sleep at some point. Oh, what's up, little snake? Are you a friendly snake? My friend has a snake and he's pretty friendly. So I guess you might... No, you're not friendly. All right, you're dead. You a dead snake now. Why do snakes have to be so aggressive? I mean, I, I, I fully understand, you know, we're in the middle of a jungle and it's kind of like eat or be eaten out here, but I said we could be friends. Wow, he really did number on me i think okay i was about to say i might actually die from the snake venom okay sweet we managed to find a pathway now i'm hoping that this leads me back to one of the tribal villages i've been to quite a few but i've never seen them actually have one of the jungle dragons do wait nope i just dealt with no snake i'm not dealing with any more snakes today what is this is this a, is this a butterfly are you are you poisonous oh there's butterflies everywhere this is like a giant monarch butterfly oh no what, what did you get attacked by a little warthog it's pumba pumba i'm pumba's dead and it's getting nice time too. Oh, this is rough. Okay, where am I exactly? This is the Crocodile Swamp, which I've been to before, and Flamingo Bay is that way. And this just says stay away. All right. It says leave me alone. Wait, 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 what? Wait, what What exactly could be over here? Um, whoa, whoa, no, no, no. Do I go down here? Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this could be it. This is where the village people could be hiding their secret jungle dragons. Oh my gosh, the crocodiles are out and about too. Okay, um, 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 what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Okay, I'm doing it. I'm doing it, ladies and gentlemen. Please, please. This has to be it, right? No, my jaguar got, he got poisoned. Okay, okay. I managed to feed him. All right, we got to get down there ASAP. I'm really nervous, ladies and gentlemen. This seems like somebody's secret hut. Is this it? <laughs> Chill. Everybody just, just take a step back. Okay, this is it. This is actually a jungle dragon. Okay, I'm going to try to uh, feed it. Do I, do I, okay. Um, what do I do? Okay, I'm just going to, I'm going to break this. Hopefully nobody's coming back here. This, I don't even know. This might be Adams. Let's see. Oh, I can feed it. There we go. Come on. A little bit more. Yes, there Okay, now let's make it bigger. Yo, bro, this guy is massive. Wait, he just ate all my food. Okay, I have a uh, cooked big animal meat. This guy just, okay, he keeps getting bigger. I think this might be max size though. This guy is huge. Oh, no! Why? What the heck, bro? Um, all right. So that actually, that that just, that happened. Luckily, I, I mean, I have another jaguar back at the house, but dude, what are you doing? 
Okay, so I can confirm this is a jungle dragon. Um, I probably should have looked up some information about it before I actually found one and tamed one, because I have no idea. I've tamed lots of dragons, but never a jungle dragon before. <laughs> okay, it says the jungle dragon is an extremely rare creature that lives in bamboo forests. They are hostile to everyone in the jungle, except for jungle villagers. Well, that explains a lot. So, if I do bring this guy back, I need to make his very own cave so he doesn't go around, you know, a attacking everything especially me i don't know if i'm classified as a jungle villager i'm a jungle chief technically so i feel like we're on good terms all right you just you stop stop roaring in my face you just you pop a squat um i thought i had a saddle but i might actually still be able to ride on its back without one okay it looks like i actually can which is great now, this is actually a nice little hideout i like it down here and there's also a chest we have coal a wooden sword oh, wait a genie lamp what does a genie lamp do wait wait do i break it i did wait what the heck is inside of that we got ourselves a toucan. We got toucan Sam. And also there's a book. Okay, Sam's survivor lived down here. Uh, he basically put his inventory. He said, I'll keep the rest of it hidden as I don't want any thieves at getting the good stuff. Oh, that means that around here, he probably hid some stuff. Okay, there's nothing behind that painting. Unfortunately, I don't have a pickaxe, so I'm not entirely sure if I can excavate the area. But let's mark down this location and later we can come back to see if there's any other things that Sam the survivor left behind. I actually, wait a second, should I go back? Yeah, I should probably sleep down there because this place is deadly, especially at nighttime. Get a bed down here, correct? No bed. My guy just doesn't have a bed. No, our jungle dragon is fighting. I'm feeding him. Oh my gosh, we literally, we barely have any food. Oh, this is terrible. Don't worry, big guy. Okay, okay, he's at max health. We're just gonna have to book it back home. This creeper's out here too. I completely forgot. I don't have to worry about just jungle animals. I have to worry about everything. Uh, please tell me he's, he's with me. Where's my jungle dragon? Where did he go? Why is a warthog fighting a snake? Get away, creature. Get away, little termite frog. Dude, what are you doing? Why are you stuck in the vines? There's a spider. Not cool. This guy's really difficult to control. Luckily, it seems like it is indeed following me so it looks like we're gonna be okay why is everything poisonous oh i'm really sorry oh this sloth is probably gonna die of poison wait where jungle dragon go jungle dragon stop killing things okay sweet we made it back to the bay now the only thing i have to do is cross all the way over to the other side without getting poisoned alive by the venomous snakes i got poisoned alive i'm dead no 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 now no, you do now you do why does everything want to kill us out here these snakes gotta chill no 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 no, no. dude this snake was like it was a trap jungle Jungle Dragon is an absolute savage, though, and he's eating them for dinner. We're so close, ladies and gentlemen. All I have to do is cross right here. Hopefully, our Jungle Dragon knows how to swim. Or maybe he could just teleport directly over. Yes, okay, he could actually swim. Let's go. Oh, this is huge, ladies and gentlemen. Wait, did I just find a secret treasure chest, too? This is awesome. Wait, there's nothing inside. Get out of here, treasure chest. I don't like you anymore. Ant Eater, how do you do? Careful around my Jungle Dragon. Apparently, he's not friendly. Wait, they have their own excavation site here. I didn't even realize. Okay, Mr. Jungle Dragon, you don't have a name quite yet. I need some suggestions from you guys down below. If you'd like to be featured, leave a like, hit that subscribe button, and comment what I should call our brand new green jungle dragon. Uh, I think for the time being, uh, this is probably the safest spot to keep it. It's basically where I found the first jungle dragon, and it seemed like it liked being in a ginormous boneyard. Uh, but ladies and gentlemen, I think this is a perfect spot to wrap it up. I hope you guys did enjoy. Be sure to smash like for more Jungle Island in the future. My name is Beckbro Jungle Explorer. Explorer Chief Jack, and I would hopefully see you guys all back again here very soon for a brand new video. Peace out, dudes.